Welcome to Beer Barbecue Baseball. We have a local uh, brew pub beer here. Um, it's Main and Mill Brewing Company. Uh, opened their doors back in 2014. They're located in Festus, Missouri, which is oh 30 miles or so south of St. Louis, down 50, Interstate 55. Um, this is their session stout. It is a 5.5% ABV, and I believe it was 12 IBUs when I looked it up. It's the Little Jafori. I'm sorry, Little Jaforia. The original session stout. Beer brewed with peanut butter, cocoa nibs, with lactose. So, haven't had a lot of beers with lactose, but ironically, um, the only two beers that I've had from this company both had lactose in it. So I'm thinking they like to use lactose in a lot of their beers. Um, lactose gives it that uh, sweeter, smoother, creamier feel uh, in your mouth. So um, let's get into it. Um, it does say this is a brew pub favorite built around the age old classic combination of peanut butter and chocolate velvety smooth with the intense complexity of an imperial stout but one you can enjoy all evening long okay so 16 ounce glass so it was canned on 220 of 20 so it's it's a stout so it should be in good shape here it is very bright out here i'm having a hard time even seeing the camera here so into the glass whoa that was a major error spilt it all over the table but wow look at that pour i can smell the peanut butter from here it's pretty fantastic you know, very creamy looking, velvety type head. It is, appears to be pretty dark. Can't tell if it's a brown or a black. I mean, it is just so bright out here right now. Wow. It has a great aroma. I get a peanut butter, of course, right off on the aroma. Get some some chocolate. That's from the cocoa nibs. And maybe just a hint of some roastiness. <coughs> but not a lot. <coughs> Cheers. That's fantastic. This beer is really good. I'm not a big stout person, um, but this is very enjoyable. Very smooth, very creamy. Leaves a real nice mouthfeel. Um, it's not heavy. Uh, it's very easy to drink. Like they said, it's a session stout. You get the peanut butter, you get the chocolate. Neither one of them are overwhelming. They blend perfectly together. Kind of like a Reese's peanut butter cup. Mmm. This is fantastic. I know their distribution is very limited um, because they are a small brew pub. And um, not sure if many of you will be able to get this, but if you ever come across it, I would recommend it. I'm going to give this a four and a half. Uh, it's that good. I mean, look how quick I'm drinking it. It's a hot, sunny, bright day in St. Louis. and. 
I, and like the can says, I could easily put a few of these back without no problem. Mm. I don't, I don't want to go on and on. It's, it's so good. Um, I just want to drink it. Again, it's Main and Mill Brewing Company and Barrel Works out of Festus, Missouri. 5.5% ABV, and again, I believe it said it was 12 IBUs. Uh, great beer. Uh, I would recommend it to anyone, even if you're not a stout person. I would I would recommend this to you. At least try it, because I think you would love it. Um, I'm not a huge peanut butter person either. These flies are going crazy here. They like the peanut butter too. But this peanut butter mix and the cocoa nibs mix they, they blend perfectly. They did a very good job on this beer. Um, and again, the other two beers I had from this company were fantastic. So uh, they're doing great things down there in Festus, Missouri at Maine and Mill. So um, I'm going to have to venture out and check out more of their beers because so far they've knocked it out of the park with all three that I've had. So great job, Maine and Mill. Uh, keep up the good work. And uh, let me know what you think about uh, peanut butter beers if you've had any. And, uh, what your experiences are with them. So thanks for watching and we'll talk to y'all in the next one.